a fucking air. I better be on fucking air. <laughs> yeah, Marty. Yeah, Marty. It's 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 fun. All right. Hey, hey. You know what? The delay wasn't bad today. The delay was ten seconds. It wasn't that bad today. But I am going to leave it alone until my buddy comes over to fix it, you know, to get the delay down because he knows how to do that crap. He knows how to kill that crap. But, hey, what can you do when you live in a shoe? And when you're a shoe end of shit. But hey man, you know what? Yeah, but my buddy can reduce that. He knows how to reduce the OBS uh, crap. So, yeah, how like he knows how to do that. Like nine second delay better here than what it was before. My goal is about 20 tonight. 20 viewers tonight. That's my goal, man. Yeah, set your 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 bit rate. Yeah, I, my buddy's gonna figure that out too. My buddy's gonna figure that out. What bit rate my computer can go to, and what it can figure out where where it should be. So. But 24 hour stream if we have non stop gaming and people in here. If, say, in the net in the 12 hours I stream and there's nobody in here, like, say, you fall asleep, then yeah, I'll end it. But I know people can't stay up for 24 hours, but we're gonna try. We are going to try. That's a lot of ways, man. 5,000 followers in 24 hours. Let's see if we can get the boogie train going. How many men have stood before me with false tales of my dragons? Desperate men, hoping for wealth, protection. Liars, every one of them. And I expect you are no different. Way. You don't want to see what I do to liars. Especially those who seek to waste my time. Something wrong with your friend? There will be if he keeps this up. Hmm. You haven't yeah, said that a would word, be nice. Celsius. 208 followers. Bang, 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 bang. Right, right in a freaking roll. That would be nice. Oh, shit. Are you frightened? I thought you'd uh, seen yeah? the dragon before. You fucking... Yeah, you fucking Your roasted me, man. Otherwise. Of course I'm afraid of him. Sarah, it's all right. Of 
course I'm a fucking afraid of him. He roasts me like a marshmallow. Would you like to touch him? Go ahead. Of course I'm gonna be afraid of him. Unless you are afraid. Of course, a man who has Unless really faced a dragon before may have reason to be that would afraid. Drag people in no. here. Not a good idea, Asha. You're brave, at least. <laughs> I don't think he likes me. You still have a hand, don't you? You claim you saw Drogon. Give me a reason to believe you. I told you I've heard this story before. I'm going to need more than that. My friend has the burns to prove it. It's likely to leave a scar. Your dragon did this, Your Grace. Well, he wouldn't. You must have tried to fight him. What have you done to him? If you've hurt him... Hurt him? He, he attacked us. Drogon wouldn't strike without reason. You must have scared him. He is not some kind of thoughtless beast. He's only a child. The men who were following us, the Lost Legion, they drew their swords and tried to fight him. And Drogon defended himself. So we somehow deserve to be burnt alive because your little baby was scared. Your tongue is dangerously sharp, sellsword. Oh, shut up. Jesus Christ, you gotta flip Why off, did you aren't come you? here? You offer me nothing but lies. Oh, you leave nothing but lies. You want gold? A title? My undying gratitude. What do you want from me, Asher Forrester? I don't want your money. I just need your help. Help very often means money. My family is depending on me. I have to find an, an army. army. If you could spare some of your cell swords, please. Wait, wait. I also came here looking case. for an army. We got to fight an but army. what I found were well, the cries of children and people suffering in chains while their masters profited from their misery. My cell swords will help me free the slaves of Marine. That is their mission. Your need is not greater than theirs. These are people who have suffered for years without end. I cannot give you the second son. There must be something I can do to convince you. As we speak, my men prepare to enter Marine. What they are about to do is much bigger than you or I. Bigger than one family back in Westeros. So, unless you think you can storm Marine and free all the slaves yourself... You have nothing more to offer me. Croft? You may leave. Oh, that's but it. Your Grace. See them out. Beska knows the city better than anyone, Your Grace. What the hell, Asher? Is this true? <sighs> yes. I lived in Marine for a time. On the eastern side of the city. Fucking bastard. So you wish to accompany them? You'd help the Second Sons. Guide them into Marine. I can't, Asha. This could be our only chance. Is that what you're saying? You're really considering this? They could prove valuable. We'll help you free the city. If you'll just consider what I've asked. We can talk about that after the slaves have been released from their chains. I believe that's more than fair. You two will join Croft and his men. Get them into the city, help them liberate Marine, and I will see that you are rewarded. But your uncle stays here. If I find you've lied or put my men in danger... I understand. Good. Croft will get you settled in. It's going to be a long night. I told you I didn't want to go back to Marine. What the hell was that? Look, I'm sorry it happened this way. As long as you get your army, right? Beska. Get your armor patched up in here. 
Extra bed rolls if you need them. Piss buckets in the corner where it's always fucking been. Long time since we had a piss bucket. I spent two years trying to get where I am now. Don't fuck this up for me, Asher. Nail! We got two more! It's not your leg that's a problem, Roderick. You've got to be practical. You want to take Griff down next time? You want to stop lying in the mud and letting people walk all over you? You're speaking to your lord, Sir Roiland. He can fight his own battles. You know why he had to stay down. Even so, it set a precedent. You don't stand a chance against Griff right now. Not in a fair fight. And I think you know that. You can't handle a sword like you used to. So find another advantage. Surprise your opponent. Do something unexpected. Like what? I'll show you. Come at me. <laughs> Bring your opponent down to your level. When I attack you, drop down, avoid my blade, and swing at the back of my knees. Wait for me to attack. Roderick! <clears throat> Let's try it again. Oh. Almost. <clears throat> again. You do it. <laughs> I think you let me. Oh. <sighs> My lord, sorry to interrupt. Elena, she insisted on seeing you immediately. Lady Elena, I hear we're to become sisters. Talia, Roderick, can I speak with you? Privately. You remember my little brother? Quiver! Good gods, you've grown. What game is it? You could just call me Arthur now. I hope you don't mind us coming unannounced. But something's happened. I didn't know what else to do. Maybe this was a bad idea. You're always welcome here. We're to be married. You'll be calling Ironrath home soon. Yes, well, um, that's why I came, actually. Lord Whitehill paid my father a visit at Rillwater Crossing. He told my father Griff had subdued you, and... And that my sister would make a fine reward. As if I'm some token to be handed around. You mean... He demanded I end Albatrothal and marry his son, Griff, instead. What? Lord threatened my family. Told my father if he refused, would be slaughtered along with you. Father acted the damn coward. He agreed, Roderick. I am to marry Griff Whitehill. That arrogant, pig-eyed prick! Elena, we're in this together. I won't let this happen. I knew you'd help. But my father won't listen. I'm not gonna be the bone they throw that howling dog. I'm not gonna be some prize for him to rip open. We have to get rid of him. I can't think of any other way. My father won't see reason. Talk like it's as simple as walking up to him and putting a knife in his heart. He's protected by a garrison of his own soldiers. We have a way around that. You 
brought your men? I command Father's elite guard. These men are trained archers, swordsmen, experts in both ranged and close combat. They're yours, if you'll help us take down Griff. The whole guard? Twenty men. My father still thinks they're aboard a ship bound for the Reach. What do you have to lose, Roderick? Griff has been a nightmare for you and your house. You can't have any reason to keep him around. This could help both of us. I have to decide what's best for my house. I know that. I know this Dude, might sound mad, but it's the only way. Get rid of Griff, and you'll be free to use the guard however you like. You can finally take control of your house again. Please, promise me you'll do this. I love you, Roderick. I don't want Griff. I don't want any of this. I'll do it, if it really is the only way. I'm afraid it is. Thank you, Roderick. I knew you'd come through for us. My men are yours to command. Thank you, Quinn. Arthur. Could you give us a moment? You don't know how much this means to me. To us, I should say. Maybe when this is all over, we could play hide-and-seek in the grove again. Pretend we're still children. Forget all that's happened these last few years. I love you, Helena. I love you too. It's another coronation already. Our kings just get younger and younger. Tommen's not ready. He's too soft. <laughs> Maybe that was the imp's plan. I wonder if Marjorie Tyrell will be there today. You mean Queen Marjorie? She was married to Joffrey. Hmm. For all I of one hour. Marry his brother too. Not to I mention Cersei and Jaime. Oh, shh. The Lannisters have spies everywhere. What is it, Tom? Remember that warning you heard from Roderick? About White Hill's contact. Did you find anything? Only whispers. But your brother's right. Blood White Hill. Blood White Hill is sending a great deal of gold to someone here in King's Land. He's definitely up to something. Something big. But I don't know what. Well done, Tom. Did you hear anything else? Lord Whitehill is surprisingly secretive. The only people I'm even certain he deals with are those ironwood merchants. They'll both be at the feast after Tommen's coronation today. Maybe you can learn something. I can't go. Marjorie's... She's not exactly happy with me right now. I've been uninvited. Couldn't Sarah help? Ask her to get you in. She'd do it, right? Don't handmaidens look out for each other? Sarah's not really happy with me either. Some things I may have said. Well, if you need Sarah to get you in there, you might as well try, right? It's nearly time. Just be careful, Lady Mira. King's Landing seems to have it in for you. cake in the kitchens. Have to guard this one. Locked him up in the old storeroom until morning. That the one who killed Brit? He's not going anywhere. Come on. 
Oh, you'll be back before anyone notices. All right. Maybe just a quick bite. He's likely to freeze to death out here anyway. And that's why it's called self-defense. Okay. Don't know what I expected. Oh, I'm not getting out that way. I can't move it. Won't budge. Garrett! Got her. What are you doing here? I heard him talking. You're to be executed in the morning. I have to get out of here. And that's why I came. I want to help. Well, you'd be executed too. Why would you want to help me? You had my back with Finn. He would have killed me over that knife. I figured it was about time I returned the favor. So I'm getting you out of here. I don't want to hear any complaining. You're a good man. You know that. Don't go singing my praises just yet. I want you to take me with you. To the North Grove. You know I can't stay here. I'm leaving Castle Black, but I'd rather not go it alone. So if you're going north, I'm coming with you. Well, I'm not going anywhere unless I can get out of this bloody storeroom first. I can try and pick the lock, but I'm not sure it will work. It's rusted a bit inside. I can try, but it may not do any good. Can you see any other way out? Working on the lock. See if you can do anything from your side. Anyway, some of that blood dog out. Not loose enough. Onions and crab apples. At least I won't starve to death. If I ever find a way out of here. That might be useful. What are you doing? Getting out of here. I can see it. It's coming loose. I'm going to try to push it out. But you pull, all right? that. Hey, can you fit through? I think. Do you sort out? No, I have no idea. I love this small, small 
Nope, I don't smoke that crap. Do what you have to do, man. to avoid Finn, but you'll turn us in the first chance he gets, trust me. Then we better be ready. I can get us through the tunnel. There's no turning back now. We're deserters for sure. We're breaking our vows. There'll be a price on our heads. Or worse.
they know we're gone now. Then how fast can you run? Wrong mother. It's Griff. He was arguing with the Maester and things got out of hand. I'm coming. What do you mean to do? Th this could be our chance. He's right. We must hurry. He's gonna see what happens when you harm a member of my family. And mine. The rest of my men are still in the grove. They could be here in minutes. I'll need every one of them for what I'm about to do. I'll have them here as soon as possible. Let's go. Nothing. Tell her. Too bad. Listen for my signal. I'll strike my cane when I want you to enter. We'll be ready. Mirror pain, fortune fame. I am insane, but memories are I'm coming insane. with you. It's not safe. You should wait for your brother. I don't care if it isn't safe. Griff thinks I belong to him. I need to show him I don't. Together then. Some more pigs on. I tried to heal it. The wound didn't. Oh, oh. Stop this at once. Why? You let that fight fester. <coughs> no, I tried. <coughs> You'd have tried no, 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 no. harder no. for a foster. <coughs> My lord, please. No. I am the only lord who matters here. Roderick. Help me. Tell your dog to obey his new master. And while you're at it, Elena Glenmore, what are you doing with him? You're supposed to be marrying you. me. You? I'd rather marry a dead horse. You watch your bloody tongue, or I'll give you what I'm giving the maester. Excuse me? What's going on here, Griff? He's disobedient, just like you were, Roderick. <laughs> before I brought you to heal. So now he's paying the price. Oh, my hand! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't believe you. <laughs> You're a piece of shit, Griff. You know that. Oh! You got quite the mouth on you, Roderick. You know what I think? My brother is ready. I think you need another lesson in humility. Just like you maester here. You can watch if you like. Actually, I think it's your turn. I don't think so, Roderick. <laughs> oh, what's the cripple up to now, eh? Fancy yourself a warrior? You are nothing, Roderick. Just give up. Not today. Accept it. You're just embarrassing him. What the hell is this? What are your orders? I'm the only one here who gives the orders. What are you waiting for? Kill anyone that moves. You heard him. Stop down. 
You can't do this. Now then, about humility. Get your hands off me! Maester, are you all right? Yes, I think so. My father will go straight to Roos Bolton. He'll flay you and your sister and your fucking family! I did warn you, Griff. You gonna hurt me? Your friends won't be around forever, Roderick. And when they're gone, I will... <laughs> Is this the man you'd rather have? This cripple. I think he wants more. Roderick! Enough! That's enough! Are you satisfied? <sighs> Is that it then? Fuck you, Roderick. Confine the White Hills to the cellars. No one gets in or out. This isn't over, Roderick! Word cannot reach High Point. You must be sure of it. Not as long as they still hold Ryan. Kill the Ravens. All of them. Alright, we gotta get some... Some viewers in here. I swear I will! Fuck you and your queen! That's enough! So long as you're in my camp, you will obey my orders! And getting pissed drunk before a mission. Obey? You know what kind of ship brain fool does that? One who wants to fucking die out there! Have you lost your damn mind? I am not some animal in a cage! What in the seven bloody hells are you talking I will not let about? you bark orders at me! Good! Hey, it's you! Maybe you uh, can talk some sense okay. into her. If you can make it past all the flagons of my ale she drank! She can't fight like this, Asher. You think I'm too drunk to fight? What the fuck What do are you, you gonna know? do? When are they swinging a fucking... Ah! Still think I can't fight? You fucking bitch! Oh, there we go. There's the asshole I remember. Ah! You could never handle a fair fight, could you? Deal with your friend! She'll get us all you killed. You sound scared, bro. This is bloody important. Are you afraid your mother will spank you? I will not let you two fuck this up. Are you up. looking forward to it? Take care of this. Because if she can't hold it together, we're leaving without the both of you. <laughs> you think your little thumbcock can take Marine all by itself? <sighs> I'd never work with a bloody show like you Best anyway! what the hell is going on? You gonna lecture me too? Oh. Oh. Croft doesn't know shit about anything. None of you do. Fuck Croft. You think I give two shits about what Croft has to say? You're the only reason I'm even fucking here. If you told your little dragon queen I would go into marine with you. I'm doing this for my family, Biscuit. This is the only way. Always about you. Your family. Your problem. Come on, Asha. Oh, if this was a real fight, you'd be dead. I'm not going to do that. What are you so afraid of? I was a slave. Here, in this fucking city. Michael Winter Cross, should I say, or things which will definitely help you amplify your Twitch view account and will help you be more successful. I was taken from my home when I was only three years old. When I was seven, my master threw me in the fighting pits to die. 
When my master tired of watching me kill animals for he started sending other children. I butchered every one of them. I, after a while, I thought the fear was gone. I thought I was used to it. You never get used to something like that. I'd ask what you were thinking, but maybe I don't want to know. There was this boy. We used to play five stones in the alley when we couldn't sleep. When I saw him next, he was in that pit with me. I saw the fear in his eyes. That same fear I felt my first time. And I realized it hadn't left me. I still wanted to live. I wanted it so badly. My master watched as I did it. Smiling. I could have killed him for that fucking smile. I knew you wouldn't understand. I bought my freedom a long time ago. I have always hated this place. Hated him. Dizzle, so because of that man. So today I'm going to be talking to you about something that I feel very strongly about and something that... Marine is a city of dead children. You can utilize this information for your streams in the best way possible. Don't worry about me. I won't let you down. Kill yourself in the process, you don't make it something that it shouldn't be, and just it makes it so much better for everybody involved. So, the one thing I'm gonna say right now, and it's one sentence that you need to know to get from two viewers to 2,000 viewers be the streamer you'd want to watch. What does that mean? It's, and I've written a blog post about this, but I also want to make this video. Right. 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 You shouldn't say that. This might be a really good time. <laughs> Why not? Mira, I'll meet you inside. Let Let's what are you doing here? I have to get in there, so. I know I'm not supposed to attend, but then you know Lady Marjorie doesn't want to see you. What could be so important? In terms of what I think that means and how it work for you, so what do I think that means? I'm the one that wrote it. I'm the one that, you know, if anybody... You're not even going to tell me why. Look, I can't get you in. Marjorie's already furious with you. And I'm not really interested in joining you on her bad side. You're on your own. Don't look at me like that. Fine. But you owe me, understand? She's with me. We'll stay out of trouble. I promise. It's a bit strange to celebrate, doesn't it? Not so long ago, King Joffrey sat on the Iron Throne. Tommen is our king now. Long may he reign. Sarah! I was worried you'd run off with your friend there. And um, what if I did? I'm not sure I could blame you. This is Lady Mira Forrester. Mira, Lord Garibald Tarwick. She's quite lovely. Where have you been hiding her? You're making her blush. Sorry, Mira. He gets a bit carried away. See, you frightened her. My apologies. It's quite a feast, isn't Nobody it? Nobody cares about me! Just be me. careful around the wine. <laughs> Though I hear you don't partake yourself. It's easy to forget 
Nothing you do in King's Landing goes unnoticed. Drink too much once and you're forever the drunken fool. Talk to the wrong people. Oh, and... don't tell it. What was that about? Nothing. That subject isn't fit for your delicate ears anyway. <gasps> oh, really? My That's ears are not we delicate. Of course they are. Look how tiny they are. <laughs> it looks. <Stop> it. <laughs> what? I mean it. Is there someone you'd rather be talking to? I have to take care of a personal matter. Oh. Well, don't let us stop you then. If you'll excuse me. This reminds me of the tourney at Lannisport. You wouldn't believe it. You told me this story. But you would have loved it. We danced all evening, drank wine from our helmets. That is it! Andros, you're being ridiculous! You can download whatever you want. It is a lot, but I know how to spell. Mm. But how did you manage it? Yeah, that'd be cool. Simply lost interest. I'm moving on to better things, as they say. Hmm, and what would that be? No, no, no. I can see what you're doing. I'm not giving away my secrets just yet. <laughs> oh, please, if you'll excuse me. Lady Mira, I'm impressed. Impressed with what? That you aren't currently locked in a cell. I trust this means that you took care of that contract. How did you do it, if I may ask? I wasn't expecting to see you again, if I'm being honest. You must have made quick work of it. If I tell you how I did it, what's in it for me? <laughs> Nothing. But I admire the gall. I do believe King's Landing is rubbing off on you. So, what have you been up to? Enjoying yourself? Though I suppose if you're talking to me, you must want something. When we first met, you were negotiating for Lord Whitehill. That's right. Do you still work with him? Well, a bold question deserves a bold answer, doesn't it? I've been pushed out of the ironwood business. Oh. All thanks to my partner. Bloody Monsieur. Andros is now Lud Whitehill's exclusive contact in King's Landing. No matter the fact that I introduced them in the first place. Why would Lord Andros want to push you out? He found a man he could manipulate. Someone who wouldn't demand an equal share. Lyman Lannister. 
He's working with a Lannister? A third cousin, to be fair. Whatever Andros is up to, he clearly thinks Lyman can take my place. <laughs> Rickard! Are you done flirting with that handmaiden? We need your opinion here. Oh, <laughs> leave him alone. Please excuse me. Listen, man. Um, excuse me. Lyman Lannister. <laughs> Shit. You startled me. As if I don't already have enough to deal with. You must think me an oaf. I just get clumsy sometimes. I'm. I'm afraid you have me at a disadvantage, Lady. Mira. Lady Mira. I'm not used to being approached so boldly. But I'm glad you did. I always feel a bit out of place at big gatherings like this. So, what brings you over here? I'm not the best company, I'm afraid. You work with Lord Andros, right? Well, yes. We do some business together. What kind of business? I... I really shouldn't talk about it. Andros came to me in confidence. You understand. He wouldn't be pleased, I'm sure. I respect that. Trust is so rare in King's Landing. I'm glad you think so. And... Damn! Just between us... Simon! What do you think you're doing? What? Nothing. You stay away from him. Andros! We were just talking. You were just talking to Mira Forrester. Forrester? I... I didn't realize. My lord? Let me say this as plainly as I can. Don't ever meddle in my affairs again! Lady Marjorie. Lady Marjorie. Lady Mira? That was quite a scene over there. Are you all right? I'm fine. I can handle Lord Andros. It's Lyman I was worried about. What do you mean? Honestly, that story isn't fit for a maiden's ears. Just be careful around him. All right? Just tell me, Lord Tarwick. It's important. I may be willing to tell you. If you'll first tell me something about Sarah. Your help could save me a lot of embarrassment. I'd be very grateful, Lady Mira. What do you want to know about Sarah? Sarah Durwell. Interesting name, that. Funny thing is, the last Durwells died off almost 200 years ago. What can you tell me about her family? Something isn't quite right, but I'm not sure. You must understand. I can't court a woman just because I like the way she laughs. She asked me not to tell anyone. But Sarah is a bastard. Are you certain? She was born Sarah Flowers. The Tyrells renamed her. How incredibly disappointing. She seems so refined. I was certain she was born a lady. She's still a lovely person, though. And if you really like her... She's a liar, Mira. And she's low-born. I'm afraid my admiration ends here. Oh, well, Thank you for being come, honest man. with me. I'm not worried about it was the least I could do. Can you picture up my camera? 
And now, Lord Tarwick, it's your turn. Right. Lyman Lannister. Ten years ago, Lyman was injured at the tourney at Lannisport. He took a bad fall from his horse, needed milk of the poppy for weeks just to keep from screaming. Oh. And between us, he's never stopped drinking the stuff. Can't stop, actually. He spent all his money trying to get more. The man can't go a day without it. So that's why he shakes? You mustn't repeat that, Lady Mira. I shouldn't even know about it. Besides, Lyman suffered enough embarrassment. And every man's entitled to his secrets. He'd be horrified if everyone knew. I'm quite serious, Mira. I'd hate for Lord Andros to trace this back to me. You learned that from Andros? The man's mouth is bigger than the black water. Poor Lyman has no idea. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some arrangements to undo. Lady Mira? I know what you're up to. I won't discuss my business with Andros, so please, please. You've landed me in enough trouble. Just shaking. It's an old injury. But there's more to it than that, isn't there? What are you saying? Either tell me what you want, or go bother someone else. I don't have to stand here and take this. You've been drinking more than wine, Lord Lyman. What? What do you... I know about the milk of the poppy. And what happened at Lannisport. No, you can't. No one can know. If you want me to keep it quiet, tell me about Andros. Andros is hiring sellswords. Hundreds of them. What? He's building an army for Lord Whitehill, big enough to march against Ironrath. But Andros is doing What's it in your secret. Idea, Marty? No one What's knows. Your idea? Or at least, he doesn't want anyone to know. I told him I'd keep remember. quiet, but... Well, now you know, gonna, No, you're not going to do that to your mother. There. You got what you wanted. But if you tell anyone what you heard about me, those cell swords won't be the only thing you have to worry about. What did I tell you? It doesn't oh, matter yeah. anymore, Andros. Oh, please. She knows everything. Lady Mira, you've just made a very grave error. Very grave indeed. You realize that, I hope.
Are you sure this is the right way? Cotter? Let's see that map again. So you're asking now, are you? Surprised you haven't taken it from my pocket already. How much food we got left? Here we are. Carried. How's the food? This won't last much longer. Oh, we'll have to stop soon. Look for some food. At least we don't have Finn to feed. We're on the right track. This way. I'll try and talk to her. I'm one of them. Cotter! They might kick me around a little, but whatever you do, don't come out, all right? She has to think I'm alone. If she sees you, you'll only make things worse. We don't think. No, I'm, uh, I'm a friend. I grew up near Ardhol. You know it? I won't hurt you. All right. You won't. I'm one of you. I'm... Oh! oh. You sure look like a crow oh, to I'm me. Not. You're dressed like one. You out here all alone, little pup. Come out or I'll kill your friend. Or I'll make him scream first. Listen, I don't want to fight. Then you shouldn't have come here. Please! He's not alone. I knew a little crow wouldn't wander off by himself. Leave him be. All right. Just... just take me. Let him go. That we're just passing through. We didn't mean any harm. Right. You and your fuckless men just want to kill us all and take our land. But you didn't mean any harm. Yeah, it's over. But you don't do it, Garrett. Let her go. We can't stay here. You're hurt. Come on. We can rest up ahead.
what they told me. I thought I'd feel better seeing Griff dragged out of the Great Hall like that. Le you wanted to kill him, didn't you? How did you know when to stop? I don't think I could have. I suppose that's why you're the Lord. I just knew it wasn't right. It wasn't the Lord I wanted to be. What do you think Lord Whitehill will do when he hears? If he truly has a spy, he won't know of this. Not until we want him to. The gates are barred and every raven in the rookery is dead. My lord, there's been a message from High Point. Lord Whitehill invites you to discuss a truce. He wants to make peace. As if we're that naive. Maybe this is an opportunity. A way to get behind their walls. And do what? You'd be putting yourself in danger, Roderick. She's right. What do you hope to accomplish? We could gather information. See how fortified their castle really is. Well, that's true, I suppose. If we're to mount an assault. We'd but welcome to the stream, everybody. Right. Everybody who comes in is more welcome to we chat. Propose a trade. And to have a, a little trade. bit of fun. Uh, we got some, some points, which I will be advertising that. Then we have a plan. We'll leave first thing tomorrow morning. If you're going ahead with this, at least bring the Glenmore soldiers. We obviously need them here. You can't mean for Roderick to travel unprotected. What if the White Hills attack Ironrath while he's gone? My lord, you cannot go into an enemy stronghold unprotected. Nor can you leave Ironrath vulnerable. We have small folk soldiers. Ironrath is ours again. The Glenmores will ensure it stays that way. Let Arthur know at once. Yes, my lord. I'll start making the preparations. To think that one of them might be spying for the White Hills. Duncan wanted you to travel to High Point without any protection. Yet Royland would leave Ironrath defenseless. Well, I'll need an advisor with me at High Point. By rights, it should be your sentinel. But for something this delicate, perhaps you best take Duncan. You're going to an enemy stronghold. Surely you want your master at arms. How could any of them betray us? I've known these people my whole life. I wish I knew. Still, we can bring only one. Royland's my sentinel. He comes to High Point. Duncan can stay here and defend Ironrath. Very well. Roderick, I know I can't come to High Point, but I can't just sit around and do nothing. I want to help. Please, I'll do anything you ask of me, even something dangerous. I don't care. What? You think I'm too young to help? I'm not a child anymore. You were every bit as stubborn when you were her age. I've known Lud Whitehill in no time. He's in prison he's now, selfish, yeah. selfish, greedy, and arrogant. But he'd never kill a guest in his own home. At least, I don't think he would. I hope you're right, Mother. I dropped the screw. In the tuna. Well, I better not eat it. Welcome. Don't worry about me. Focus on the mission. Your family needs you. That's what matters right now. I know you'll make them proud. All right, General Ford is back in business. Good luck, my boy. <laughs> Trying to catch up on Bugs Bunny. Hey, that's a good show. I like that. General Ford like the Looney Tunes.
<laughs> yeah. Shall we begin? Yeah, it's true. Listen up. There are four of these guard posts throughout the city. They'll use them to warn the masters in case the slaves decide they're tired of wearing chains. We're here to make sure they don't see it coming. Theron, you take the north. Pen, that the is south. Fun. Asher, we'll take the east. Isn't it Elmer Fudd? And Kieran will cover the west. Make the enemy blind. Give the Unsullied a chance to get in and arm the slaves. The rest is up to them. Don't get cocky out there. One mistake and the man will remember when we stole that giant war hammer. Get in. Do what you have to do and get your people Didn't she hit you in the face with it? That's all you I need never to thought my about. head could feel any You got that. Tonight, any man who wishes to be free may take that freedom from the grip Older of his than master. the Oakland Raiders in the last arc. That's exactly. Alone. It's all, Justice man. Justice belongs to the people of Marine. Do not make them wait any longer. What does she know of justice? Is there a problem? If you can't do this, tell me now. The Masters will be judged by the people of Marine, not by you. You don't have to worry about us. Just point us at the people you want dead. We'll take it from there. You enjoy this far more than you should. Kill only those you must. You will both do as Croft commands. Follow his orders exactly, or you will get nothing. Now go. Show them the hell they have made here. Yeah, older than the Oakland Raiders and the the last arc. <laughs> yep. Ooh. I hoped I'd never see this place again. Tried to run once. Didn't make it very far. Private number. Hello? Nothing much. Streaming. Which way? There's a path around there. Avoids the main street. Let's just get this over with. Um, I guess so. I'm, I'm cleaning up, so I'll see you around five. Okay, no problem. Sorry about that. It was uh, it was an important phone call. But uh, what's the matter, Croft? You see how many guards are out there? How were you expecting to get past them? We'll be caught. You ask me which way. This is it. Then we'll stay out of sight. Follow me. Fuck, that kid's got to get his own fucking mic, man.
Can you see anyone? Cover me. What happened? Yeah, okay there, buddy. I don't fall for that. Oh, been used recently. <laughs> don't fall for that. Marty. Yeah, okay, buddy. Okay, Marty. Whatever you. Yellow and Misha. Nicely wash. Shell shitly wash. Spalsa washka. A nicely wash. Oh, you should have told me. You should have told me. We have to go. There's something I have to do. Vesco, what are you doing? Do you trust me, Asha? We don't have time for this. Just tell me. Do you trust me? I need to know. This won't take long. Where the fuck are you going? Follow her! Killed you. I should have killed you. 